Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am doing the end of year curriculum review for my fifth grader. And in today's video, I have a special guest. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so what other way to do an honest end of year curriculum review than the person who actually did the curriculum? So we're gonna go by, we're gonna go one by one with each curriculum and materials that he used and he's just gonna review everything. You're gonna tell them what you liked about it, what you didn't like about it. Um, <laughs> if you're gonna use the next level next year and all that, okay? First up, we're starting with handwriting. This past year he has used handwriting without tears, the cursive handwriting. So give your honest review. Did you like it? Did you did not like it? Nope. Which one? Mm, no, I didn't like it. Why you didn't like it? I didn't like it because it when it when you learn about the cursive, it's way different. It's like it's not what you learned. You can't read it. Okay. So backstory: He has used the Good and the Beautiful's handwriting, and we wanted to use something different, change it up. And we got handwriting without tears, the cursive handwriting. So, would you use the next level next year? I'm going back to uh, good and the beautiful. Okay, we're going back to good and the beautiful next year. Mm -hmm. Next up, we have my Catholic Speller level C. Did you like it? Did you not like it? I liked it. What you liked about it? I like that you learn about stuff from like kind of from the past i guess like the bible yeah the bible it's a spelling curriculum but it also teaches about our faith and it has um bible verses in there and um it's just also another material that he is learning about his faith so you like it mm -hmm. you're gonna use the next level next year okay for math, we have Simply Good and Beautiful Math 5. Did you like it? Did you did not like it? I liked it. Poor way. Did you like it? <laughs> yeah, Mostly? It. No? Mostly. What you did not like about it? Uh, I did not like how... Be still. Uh, <laughs> it... It's tough for some of the problems. Some of the problems are harder? At the end. At the end? You get into the 6th grade level yeah. at the end? Do they preparing you for the sixth grade? Yeah, sixth grade must be hard. <laughs> <laughs> so you like it enough to do yeah. level six? Okay. Moving on to fix it grammar level one. Do you like it? Like you it. Like it. You liked it. it? What you like about it? I liked how they put fun and school together in a book. Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> this is good. So you're gonna move on to level two next year? Okay. Oh, wait. Uh, <clears throat> for science this year we did exploring creation with human anatomy and physiology did you like it did you did not like it i did not like it why you didn't like it i didn't like it because i liked how you do experiments but i did not like how it's just about the body i don't like the body you don't like the body i don't like yeah. science about the body okay but did you like learning about certain things yeah i like i like i liked learning about uh how like your food digests and all mm -hmm. that. But other than that, I didn't like it. You didn't like the textbook or you didn't like doing the journal part? I didn't like doing this. Okay, I noticed that. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Yeah. This is hard. <laughs> That's hard. I did like learning about some of these things in here, but whenever it came down to the journal part... Nope. So do you want to do this the next level next year? At the bottom. What what type of sciences do you want to learn about? I like science about like nature of space. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So if you have any space or nature recommendations, go ahead and comment down below so I can find a science for him next year. He'll be in the sixth grade. And next year we're doing science with just him. Yay. Hi. 
Next up for history, we have Biblio Plan, um, The Ancient Days. I liked it. You liked it? What you liked about it? I liked how some of the stories are how, like, God saved, like, the uh, his people. Mm -hmm. Then when it came to the end, I just, I don't know how to explain it, but I just liked it. You liked it? Okay. I'm going to say I liked learning about the biblical part of history, but I did not like reading those big, long names. Big, long names that we don't even understand. No. Okay, so you want to do this next year? Mm -hmm. um, I think it's the medieval times. <laughs> next, for his reading in literature, we have the treasure trove of literature level, level one, and he read... That... What is the name? Little House in the Big Woods, The Father Brown Reader, Men of the yeah, Mississippi. Mississippi. Um, he is not reading this and we're skipping it because we took a big break. And then he's going to finish off with this one. What was your favorite story so far? I liked Little House in the Big Woods and Men of the Mississippi. Yeah? You don't like Father Brown? No. It gets... It, one place is over here, then the next place is over here. It was here. a mystery I don't, I don't book. understand it. <laughs> Did you like doing this? <laughs> yeah, I like doing it, though. What you didn't like about it? Because see, so they can see. Let me see. Nothing? No, Okay. I like it. Um, so we're going to move on to level two next year. Okay. Picked up a handful of books that he has read this past year, so he's going to do a mini review. If he liked it, if he didn't like it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Okay. Okay. We have The Mystery of the Night Explorers. I kind of liked it. Next, we have The Imagination Station, book two, Attack on the Arena. That was fun. You like this one? Do you like this series? Yeah. Next we have the Iliad and I still have the price tag. I started reading it and it was pretty cool. Yeah, because we read some about it of it in history. So he just picked this up. He's almost done, maybe? Uh, yes, I'm coming. Well, I like maybe chapter three, four. <laughs> Next, we have the journey of Ching Li. Lei. I think I like it because mm -mm. the name. I didn't know how to pronounce the name. And what was the story about? The story was about him and his father. I, th I think it was his father. They went into a mountain. Everything in China. China and I don't know. I haven't read it in a long time. So. This is a level three reader. And then we have the Father Brown reader. Like I said, it was at one place, then the other. I did not like it. It was one back and forth confusing? Yes. Okay. Woodworking, I got this kit for him at the beginning of the year. And what you think about it? It was fun. It was fun? It's very hard though. Yes. <laughs> Would you, you, gotta, you gotta learn. Would you continue? learning about it yes is there anything or any topics you want to learn specifically about or do it could be anything that's it i like what i do <laughs> that's it for our fifth grade point of view end of year curriculum that is it for this video. <laughs> that is it for this video bye guys